morning. Time to make the coffee. Keto coffee. Instant individual packet already includes all the good for you stuff. MCT oil, collagen, grass fed butter. I've already opened the packet actually, but again, it comes in an individual packet. Here's my powder. I'm going to make hot. Now, I just wanted to come on today to talk about all the great ways you can enjoy the keto coffee. Of course, you can just do the pack with water, which I'm about to add in. Or you can add more to it again. You can have it just straight that way, not add anything to it for people that do intermittent fasting and that kind of stuff. You know, if you do your, I forgot the numbers of the hours, however many hours you go without eating and you're getting up in the morning. You can have the coffee that'll help to keep you sustained until that 11, 12, 1 o'clock hour when you start your eating window again. So it would just be coffee and the water plain. But for people like me that like to doctor it up a little bit, I add a little bit of heavy whipping cream, normally about two tablespoons. That's all you need, you know, because again, this does have calories. So about two tablespoons of heavy whipping cream. I also add to mine a little bit of sugar-free flavored syrup. Today I'm actually going to do French vanilla. This is what I'm going to add in mine today. You can also add some heavy whip, heavy whip cream. So again, sugar-free heavy whip cream. I think I got this from oh, Walmart. So again, a sugar-free heavy whip cream because remember, your whole keto, you're definitely cutting out the sugars. You're definitely cutting back on your carbs, doing a lot of the high good fat. That's what this includes. High, good fat, grass-fed butter, avocado, you know, other type of oils, coconut oil, that kind of stuff. Helps the body to burn fat for fuel. Get rid of those carbs. Something else people would do, again, if you're adding a heavy whipping cream, you may want to add to some little flavored syrup. I do have this, some caramel flavored syrup that would then go on top of it. Again, sugar-free. All the good sugar-free stuff. If you're a person where you're like, ah, I'm not down with that coffee flavor of the keto coffee itself, guess what we have? You can use your own regular coffee and then add keto creamer to it. The keto creamer does the same thing, has the same in ingredients minus the caffeine of the keto coffee. So you're still getting your MCT oil, you're still getting your grass-fed butter, you're still getting your collagen. So again, you can add the keto creamer to a variety of stuff as well. Nice, easy, simple. Let me get my boiling water. I love my little I Love Mom mug for my daughter. Something on Saturdays to you. And it's big. Add some water. So again, you can do the coffee without adding anything to it. Just the mix and some water. I do use a frother. It's easier for mixing. Uh, you guys can't really see that. But it's easier for mixing. Gets it to a nice, smooth consistency. Um, no lumps. If you just do it with a spoon, depending on how you do it, you may end up with some lumps. But um, using the milk frother, I think I got this from Amazon for about, I don't know, maybe six or seven bucks. Nice, easy, simple. Definitely is a handy dandy tool to have if you're using keto coffee, bulletproof coffee, any of the stuff where you're mixing in the butters and stuff. Um, this just helps to smooth it out. Too bad you can't really see it. I don't want it to empty out. So looking at the coffee, again, this is just the coffee in and of itself. Gonna add a little, just another notch of water. In and of itself, it's just it's smooth, creamy. Um, definitely buttery though. If you do it by itself, let's blow. Again, it is fine. <clears throat> it is fine this way as well. I add it and doctor mine up, but people, you can definitely drink it just plain. Coffee taste for sure. 
the richness with the um, oil and the butter. It's great. But again, I do more with mine. So I'm going to add just a couple drops of heavy whipping cream again. Try to just do about two, about two tablespoons. Again, my sugar-free oil. Same, about two tablespoons. Whip, whip, whip again, just for a little bit. And again, you will feel energized drinking the keto coffee. You would definitely um, be feel full. Your, your appetite will be curbed again. Sometimes I can drink, um, if I do my coffee in the morning, and I sometimes drink it normally about 6 in the morning, definitely between 6 and 7. If I don't drink it before I get to work, I'm drinking it once I get to work. And not really hungry till maybe about 1 o'clock or so in the afternoon. Um, gives you that focus for sure. Gives you the energy boost. And again, it's good for you. It's definitely um, been one of the staples that have helped me as I have been on my little um, health and wellness journey to include losing some weight. You guys have heard it before, down from 234, 235. And actually, I got on the scale this morning. I told you guys I'm obsessed. And this morning, I was actually 194. So we'll see what happens on Tuesday when we have our weigh-in for work. But again, this is what I normally add to mine every day. Some heavy whipping cream, a sugar-free flavor, but you then have the whole other list of things you can add, you know, doctored up, add you some whipped cream, add you some um, syrup or whatever to it and enjoy. And if not, our coffee, creamer. You got the creamer that can be added to tea, it can be added to other foods that you're cooking, again, just to get those same benefits, so... Happy Saturday. Cups up. Enjoy your coffee. Oh, delicious. Have a blessed day, folks. Peace. Oops, I forgot to share how you can get in touch with me if you're interested in getting coffee or creamer or any other um, of my uh, products. Again, I am a It Works Health and Wellness brand ambassador. I am a hope dealer. Um, if you're interested in information, definitely feel free to reach out to me um, at emarielee.myitworks.com or even at my email address, which is emarielee63 at gmail.com. This contact information, it is included in the description box underneath or maybe above the video. I'm not sure what your layout may be, but the contact information is there. And it's also listed in the about section, which is on my channel. So um, definitely feel free, more than willing to share any of the information um, about any of our product line. And also, if you go to uh, my website and you would just click on shop and you can then click through the various products. Um, once that opens up, there's a link that takes you to product info. It includes frequently asked questions there as well. So um, many, many ways to get all types of information again. I 100% stand with my product line because I am a product of them and I know they definitely work. So, cheers and check it out. Reach out as you need to. Peace.